Hello again, YouTube. This is Beanie Bomb, and welcome back to another episode of Fallout New Vegas. Haha! -ha. Last episode, we just completely obliterated and destroyed the Powder Gangers. And also, if you can tell, the frame rate is a lot better than the last episode. I dimmed down the graphics a bit, and I also have it in a windowed mode, so that should help. Also, I'm recording at 2:25 a.m., so I'm going to be a bit quieter because I do not want to wake my parents. Um, <laughs> So, uh, yes, let's continue with whatever we were doing. I don't even, like, know what we we're doing. Let's check. c c, -c, -c quests por favor. Uh, also, you should notice that my mic quality is better because I actually equalized the sound in FL Studio. So that takes a little bit more work, but I'm, I think I'm gonna do it from now on so I can sound awesome. Uh, let's see, inquire about your delivery. Sierra Madre Grand Opening. Oh yeah, this is the, the, uh... All the downloadable stuff, the Midnight Science Fiction, Happy Trails, and the Sierra Madre Grand Opening. So let's see. Reunion, travel to the canyon wreckage near Prim and enter the Divide. I think that might also be uh, uh, DLC. So let's just activate the one that isn't DLC for now so we don't get our butts kicked. Uh, <laughs> did we search all of the powder gangers? I do believe we did, but we just didn't want it. Want all of it. Uh, let's check you. Let's see, 20 gauge round, that's actually helpful. A cowboy hat, uh, sure. Dynamite, thank you. Uh, something. And a shotgun, I'll take it. Ooh, yeah, we did not search all of them. Because they've got awesome things. Oh yeah, also a funny thing with this game, look what happens to his clothing. If I take his outfit, and then exit, boom, now he has a shirt. <laughs> oh, funny, funny. Alright, let's see. I don't want his clothing though. Meh. I'll just keep it for funsies. Maybe I could sell it. Ooh, a bottle cap. Thank you. A cleaver. Bonus limb damage. We'll take that. For dismembering our foes after we've d d bested them. <laughs> oh, look at that. 20 gauge round. Bottle caps. Dynamite. Uh, we'll take that to repair the other one with. Hmm. Very nice. Very nice. Thank you. Take your, your, no, nah, you can keep your baseball cap. Probably has some sentimental value. Even though you're dead, I won't take that away from you. <laughs> Alright, let's check our items now that we have stuff. Alright, apparel. Let's see, metal armor. I bought that, so I'm going to be wearing it. <laughs> the simple outfit, uh, medium agility minus one. Oh, that's not good, but it does have a DT of 12. This has a it's what? What? I don't understand. Damage threshold of 12. Sun has a DR of dot dot. I don't know. He is wearing a vest though, so I think that could mean that he can... T I don't know why it doesn't have a DT. I'm going to drop it though. Uh, let's put on the hat just for funsies. And now we will look at ourselves. Oh, look at us. Look at how ballin' we are. Oh, I don't look good in this lighting at all. Ew. Ugh, what's wrong with my face? Oh. <laughs> Let's look at here, this lighting. Mm, yes, I'm a contemplating cowboy. The pastiest skin ever. I probably should have made my skin a bit more tan. Oh well. I think I need to adjust the mouse sensitivity, though, in this resolution. So I'm gonna do that real quick. Sorry! Gave like, uh, no. Back. Uh, controls sensitivity. Put that up twice. And we'll go back, back, and continue. Ah, much better. Okay, let us go and talk to this person. Because there's more to do here, isn't there? Or is there not? Uh, I actually don't think there is any more. But I don't have any ammo for this weapon. So I'm going to change to... I don't even know why I did that. I'm going to change to a different gun. Uh, or I could go buy uh, energy cells from that dude. But I don't want to. We will switch to our mm, grenade rifle. Well, oh yeah, can we repair? Yeah, because they're both in pretty bad condition, so we'll repair this with that. Haha! -ha! And uh, we'll, we'll put that on. Good. Oh, we actually have a lot here. We'll put that on, and then we'll use the shotgun later. Sweet, sweet. So now we are on our way to do something. I don't... Today... Did we search you? Uh, yeah, we did. He's got the silly varmint rifle. Alright, let's see. Where actually are we going? Hmm. Uh, 
data or data, either one. Local map, world map, blah, blah. Let's see, where, where are we headed? Can I drag? I do drag. Okay, I'm going over here. I don't know where that is, but I think I can teleport here for a quicker travel time. <laughs> the sturdy protection model of robot was created before the Great War and served as a security automation in both the private and business sectors. And that little roulette wheel on the bottom has stopped spinning. And, uh... Oh, okay, there we go. It stopped responding for a second, but that's okay. That's what PC games do. They they load, and then they stop responding, and then you're all good. They, they make you feel afraid, as if you might have lost all of your data. So just in case we did lose all of our data, let us quick save real quick. I think F5 is the quick save. Yes, it is. <laughs> oh, before you venture deeper into the wasteland, you may revise your character. Ah, cool! Uh, let us rebuild because I, I was just complaining about that pasty skin issue. Ugh, you are pasty, boy. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Caucasian. Na -na -na -na. Uh, customize. I, I swear this won't take as long as before. Shade. Ooh, paste, paste. Not as pasty. Let's see. That's a bit better. Um, let's see, put that down a little bit more. There, that's kind of the tan that I'd expect being out in the sun all the day. So we'll keep it there. Maybe a little bit more up. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, let's see, what is this? What's that? What is that? Oh, okay, I see. So that's kind of like sunburn. Uh, we'd have a slight sunburn to be realistic. And, uh, that is good. We'll put the blue tint down a bit, I think. Yeah, that looks a bit more realistic, actually. And then, um, eye sockets. Adjust those. Uh, yeah, I'm a hardened, I'm a hardened delivery boy, so I'll have some eye I pockets, whatever they're called, <laughs> and then bags, eye bags or whatnot, eyebrows, oh yeah, let's put that there, eyeliner, whoa, I didn't go into this, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll make him emo, uh, <laughs> nose, let's see here, what does this do, uh, mm, put that there, lips, gouda gouda, gouda gouda, gouda gouda gouda, gouda gouda gouda, put that there, <laughs> Mustache. I don't have a mustache, but I'll give him one. Cheeks. Put that all the way there. And beard. Last but not least, of course. Look at him. He's so hardened. Let's put this down a bit. Right around there. Eh. There's better. Perfect. All right. Back. Back. Next. Done. Are you sure you want this to be your character? Yes. And, uh, oh cool, I've got five points. Did, when did I level up? <laughs> I, I'm not complaining. Wait a minute. Distribute five points. I get to increase my special. Special. Oh, nice. Nice. Uh, wait a minute, didn't we already do that? Oh, lame. Okay, then. Crap, we already did this, though. Can I, like, not do that? Lame. Ah, uh, whatever. Okay, then. We'll just do it again. Maybe we'll, we'll maybe we'll do it better this time. Okay, so I'm gonna be using the regular guns and plasma guns or plasma energy weapons. So I think agility affects your guns and sneak skills. So we'll put one of that in there. Um, science, repair, and medicine. That's important. Charisma. That is also important. Endurance is a measure of your overall physical fitness. High endurance give you bonus to health. Environmental. Mm, that's pretty important, but we can get that after we leveling up. Perception grants bonus to explosives, flocks, picks, and energy weapons, which is what I want. And then strength, uh, yeah, that's important for carrying capacity, but I think endurance might be, mm, nah. Let's see, luck, raising your luck will live all your skills a little, have a, having a high luck will also improve your critical chance of weapons. Hmm, carrying, or a little bit more carrying, plus a tiny bit more endurance. <laughs> We'll go carrying. No, wait. I lied. If you have a high luck, you can find items better. Ah, all right. There we go. Okay, now we've got our perks, guns, medicine, and speech. Maybe instead of guns, medicine, and speech, we should go guns, energy, weapons, and speech. Hmm, this is a hard choice, actually. Maybe we don't even need speech. All, all hmm. Hmm. Maybe I should just stick to one weapon type. <laughs> but
But I already assigned my special so I could have both. Okay, so since I'm gonna have both anyways, I might as well just like take the speech away and put it on my energy weapons. Done. Okay. Oh, jeez, golly. <laughs> it's making me do all of this again. I, I don't remember choosing any of these. Uh, except for Wild Wasteland. I remember choosing that. And, uh, unless I didn't. Oh, well, I want to now. <laughs> Let's see. Logan's loophole. No one's going to put you in plaster because you're going to stay young and level 30 forever. Oh, yeah. That's bad. When your health drops below 50%, you gain 10% more damage, but you also suffer. Uh, but that's only when it's below 50% health. Hmm. Hmm. That, well, that, that describes me in real life, so we'll do that. Except I don't lose my perception and my agility. Hmm. No. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. You gain 25 pounds to carrying capacity, but suffer one all total attribute. That's a horrible thing. Good nature at heart. More prone to solving problems in your mind than violence. No. Four eyes. Fast shot. While using guns and energy weapons, you fire opponent. Less accurate. That's bad. Early bird. Early riser, enjoy it. Plus two to each of your special attributes from 6 a.m. to 12 p.m. But suffer. Uh, isn't there one where it was like, um, the opposite of fast shot? Because I think I might want that one actually. You're skilled but not experienced. You gain plus five points to every skill, but you suffer 10% minus from experience gained. <laughs> Lame. Okay, smell frame. Trigger discipline. Oh yeah, trigger discipline. When firing guns and energy weapons, twenty percent more slowly, but twenty percent more accurate. Mm, I think I want to do that to conserve ammo, but I might regret it later. So I'm just gonna stick with everything being the way it is, and then bam, uh, finish. Travel onward. Mwah. All right, look at all that XP. Do we level up? No. Okay. <laughs> all right, we are now officially. Oh, we do level up. Cool. <laughs> Welcome to level two. What do you mean, welcome to level two? I leveled up to like level eight. Ah, oh, that sucks. <laughs> that really does suck. Lame. Okay, whatever. We'll just put it all in medicine. Oh, we already have medicine. We'll put it all in speech then. Unless we need repair. We did increase our repair. No, we didn't actually. We'll go. We have 13 skill points, so might as well put this to 25. And then. On, we'll put it up. Uh, science is primary act. Can be used to recycle energy weapon ammunition. Nah. Mail weapons medicine. Lock pick is pretty. It's kind of important actually. It's not that important. I think repair would be more important. So we'll just put the rest in there. All right, and continue. And we get to choose this. Swift learner. See shrink total experience points whenever experience. We want that. Ah. And is that all we can choose? Yes. Do I want anything else? Retention. Rapid ability to kill or intense training. Intense training. You can put a single point into any of your special. Ooh. That's actually good. Okay. And done. And then now, since we have an extra thing, we will put one into strength so we can carry more. Done. Awesome. All right, I feel I'm feeling good about this character now. Let's let's see. Is he still super paced face? God, zoom out a bit. Jeez. Okay. Let's see. No, he is not. He looks relatively like a normal human being, which is kind of hard to accomplish in this game. I saw a little red thing on my mini map. Mm hmm. Ah, where are you? Are you a human or a bug or an animal of some sorts? Either way, you will be destroyed. Mm hmm. Oh, you're a thing. Boom, bam, bam, zam. <laughs> you did get destroyed. Golly, look at that. Give me your precious, precious meat. Lag spike. Uh, gecko hide. Egg. What does the egg do? Take the meat. Uh. Nah, I don't want the egg. I probably am going to need it later, but oh well. Oh, it's a tumbleweed. Let's kick it. I want to kick it. Yeah. Ugh. Oh yeah, also I want to download the uh, sprint mod for this, because that will be awesome if I can have the sprint mod, because right now all shift does is make me walk even slower. Uh, but apparently take faster footsteps. Oh, never mind. <laughs> it did before. Alright, let's see. Should be true. Ooh, radiation. You take a sit from your trusty through the Volt 13 canteen. What does that do, taking a sit? I never understood that, and I still don't understand. Let's see, what's in here? Is there any salvageable items? 
in this radioactive pit of despair? No. Just radiation. That's all there is. And that's all there ever will be. Ever will be? Uh-huh. I think that's correct. <laughs> that's all there will ever be. Uh, in this fallout. Bum, bum. <laughs> I'm a lame announcer. Hey! Guess what? Mmm. Not, not good enough for me. So we're gonna actually, we're gonna wait, and then we're gonna go, oh, he's gonna shoot something at us, I think. Prepare yourself, boat fly! You will be destroyed! Bam, look at me. I'm wearing a cowboy hat, so that means I'm automatically better at shooting than this boat fly. Yummy, boat fly meat, my favorite. <laughs> Alright, let's see, what else enemies are there? Other enemies, I see one. Oh, it's another boat fly. The surprise of a lifetime. Boat fly, die. Boat fly, boat fly, die, boat fly. Boom! I wasn't expecting you to hit it there, actually. Whoa, it's a gecko! Look out! Oh no, look out, it's a gecko! Vats! Vats, quickly! Help! He, uh, token! Boom! <laughs> uh, bullets, if you didn't know, actually do that in real life. If you shoot someone in the head, they get just clean cut through the neck decapitation. Uh, so this game is highly realistic in that regard. <laughs> I'm just kidding, it doesn't matter. I do not care. I actually like the fact that you can decapitate people with bullets. You can do that with a special arrow. It's really cool. I saw it on Zombie Go Boom, and if you haven't heard of Zombie Go Boom, I highly recommend watching it, because it's really fun to watch. Uh, but there's this dude with an arrow, and the arrow, once it hits someone, it had a- Oh, fast travel. You have discovered several search locations. You can fast travel back. I already know how to fast travel. I've done it. I've done it before. But, uh, he had this special arrow that whenever there was pressure on the tip, it would shoot out blades from the side, and it would decapitate things, and it was awesome. Uh, how do we get in there exactly? I don't think this really led us to the pro- I'm gonna have to go over here. I actually remember from all the other times I played, there's a dude over here that I'm gonna talk to, and look, it's the NCR. Uh, yeah, California. My favorite place. Hey, where the hell do you think you're going? Prim is off limits. No, it isn't, silly. <laughs> What's going on in Prim? I can take care of myself. Thanks for the warning. Uh, that wasn't very kind, so I'm not gonna be kind for himself. I could take care of myself. I killed, like, a billion powder gangers. It's your ass. Don't say you weren't warned. Yeah. Hey, hey, sir. I have a question for you. Do you know what that question is? Bullet to the brain is the question. <laughs> No, I'm just kidding. Let's go back. <laughs> All right. Excuse me, sir. If you got something to say, say it to the lieutenant. Okay, to the lieutenant. Inquire about your delivery assignment with the administrator of the Mojave Express in Prim. Find the men who tried to kill you. Okay. I feel like I'm not exploring enough. Mm. Is exploration a good idea, sir? Sir, is exploration a good idea? Sir. Patrol in the Mojave almost makes you wish for a nuclear winter. Okay, so exploration is definitely a good idea because patrolling is the opposite of exploration. It's like staying in one space. So I will I will explore a bit more. Is there anything in this bus that I can take home and, and call it my own? I don't think so. I do not think so at all. How, how the heck do I get... Whatever, I'm just gonna walk down here. I don't care what you have to say, broken bus that's blocking my way. I will walk down here all of the day until you say, Wait, not that way, and I will not care. Oh, hey, look, ammo boxes. Uh, why is that red? Am I, like, not allowed to open the ammo box? I am hidden. I'm gonna take it. What? I lost karma! Yes, I don't want to lose karma. I'm a good guy. <laughs> okay, let's let's go down. Enough shenanigans. Sometimes though, there will be like a box that you can't search, or else you'll lose karma. And then other times there will be a box that you can search right next to it. So we're gonna check this one. If it's red, I do not want to search it. It is red. Okay. All right. I do believe we're going the right way. Even though our walking speed is negative 18. <laughs> or our jogging speed, I should say. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Kinda wish I could zoom out more than this. Like, super far. <laughs> like Skyrim. Let's you zoom out a lot. Bam, bam, bam. 
I take a sip. No, I don't. I was just aiming. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Hmm. 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 There's, there's a whole world out there for us to explore. But I, I, I have things to do right now. <laughs> and this episode hasn't been very eventful. So, we're gonna try and make it as eventful as possible before things run out. Look at that roller coaster. That looks like a mighty fine roller coaster, depending on how fast it goes. If it's one of those roller coasters that, like, break you so that the other cart, or if you're, like, in the front, you're, like, already all the way down the drop before it actually lets you go so the other carts can have fun, too. Or it doesn't go too fast. Yeah, like the ones at Disneyland. I don't like that. Ooh, powder gangers, look out! It's a trap! Oh! Oh! Oh no! Ow! Ha! Ah, I've got armor that protects against your silly, silly bullets. You cannot handle me, silly. Boom, bam, bam. Oh, right in the knee. Ha, ha, ha. Take it. Boom. I like how whenever you reload, you just put the clip in. Like, you don't bother taking the other clip out. It just... Oh, wow, look at that. A hundred dollars. Where's eighty dollars? I'll take it. Uh-huh. Hockey mask. Merc troublemaker. Damage threshold is one, but you get plus two to melee weapons and plus two guns. I, won't, I don't want it. Psycho. Don't want to get addicted to anything in this game because that's actually really bad. Sunset sarsaparilla. Tire iron and a varmint rifle. Thank you for your useless thing. So I can't I take, take the ammo unless that's just for show because you're a poser and it wouldn't surprise me. I like your outfit though, sir. It's very classy. <laughs> uh, wow, five... $5 NCR things worth $10. Wait, if the $5 thing is worth $10, then why is the $100 thing worth 80 caps? Is what I meant to say, not dollars. Ah, oh well, logic. It doesn't make any sense anyways. Bottle caps. Ooh, cool. Dynamite! Varmint rifle. I don't want your varmint rifle. Can you see that I, I'm just not gonna use it? Let's ride the roller coaster before we go in there. <laughs> I just wanna... I want to ride it, and I do believe there's people patrolling here, so I want to clear them out so they don't cause problems. All right, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, please. Okay, can't go that way. Ladies and gentlemen, please keep your hands and arms and legs inside the ride at all times. Yeah, uh, yeah. Oh god, this is a horrible roller coaster. It sucks. Okay, we're doing good. We just need to go up, and we're on. Okay, there's a dude. I was right. Oh, he's attacking. He's seen me. It's a trap! Oh, yeah, 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 yeah! Boom! Bam! 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 Oh, I thought he had died. Oh no! Vets! Watch this. Headshot! Boom! Uh, right in between the eyes. No, don't fall off! Ah! I needed your stuff. Blast! All right, this roller coaster is dangerous. I'm getting blood on my my lens and everything. Like, look at that! Look at that! That's just danger. Woohoo, look at that. Oh wow, that's a that would be a really fun drop in real life. Actually. Uh that's like about the size of the drop at uh six flags. Um what is it? Goliath or Colossus? Colossus. Uh okay, I'm probably gonna take fall damage, but YOLO. Uh ow my ah! legs. Yep, I did. I'm just grad grad I'm just glad I didn't cripple them. I do have a lot of stim packs though. So that's that's good. That is good. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Let's see what is in here. A leather belt. That's actually, that's good for sharpening knives, in case you didn't know. Uh, after you're done sharpening it, you just rub it across the leather belt going away from the blade so you're not, like, peeling into it. You just sort of rub it, and it, uh, it prevents serration, and it makes your knife blade a lot neater and sharper and cuttier. <laughs> uh, yeah. So, let's continue. I'm talking about knife sharpening because I have actually been getting look at that sun beautiful been getting into whittling again because I used to do it when I was in Boy Scouts but I don't like Boy Scouts boring uh, I did go on a camping trip though for a while and uh, game is not responding but it's okay because it's gonna load soon. see I don't know what it was brought you to prim youngster but you might want to rethink your plans town's gone to hell uh who are you I have some questions about Prim. Want to play a hand of care? <laughs> yeah, just first thing when you see someone warning you about 
or bringing up conversation topics to be like, hey, you want to play caravan? <laughs> uh, or just say goodbye. I don't know. Let's ask who you are. Johnson Nash is my name. Husband of Ruby Nash. Lived in Prim going on eight years now, thick and thin. I'm a trader primarily, for what it's worth with things like they are. I also run the local Mojave Express outpost. I'm a courier with the Mojave Express. I don't like your, 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 your place though, it isn't safe. I got shot in the head twice. Well, I don't got any work right now, sorry to say. I lost the package I was supposed to deliver. I'll tell you whatever I can. You have a delivery order you can show me? What can you tell me about this job? Oh, so you're talking about one of them packages. That job had Strange written all over, but we couldn't turn down the caps. What was strange about it? Some men stole my package, a man in a checkered suit, and some thugs did they pass this way. I'll ask that. Well, now that you mentioned it, a few nights back, one of the townies was out scavenging for supplies. He said he saw a fellow with a daisy suit come through with some of them great con misfits. They was talking about a chip. One of those men shot me twice in the head. I need to know the best way to get to them. What's strange about it? I'd like to ask you. One of those men shot me. Well, for that, your best bet is going to be talking to Deputy Beagle. Since they came to town, he was keeping a good bit of notes on them. And he was slinking around Bison Steve when your pretty boy friend came through. My pretty boy friend. He may have heard where they were going. Uh, let's see. Complete. Inquire. Oh, that was easy. Uh, Prim's deputy has been captured by the powder gang unit in steam to Bison Steve and needs to be rescued. Okay. Uh, what was strange about the package? That cowboy robot had us hire six couriers. Each was carrying something a little different. A pair of dice, chess piece, that kind of stuff. Last word I have in the office, it looked like payment had been received for the other five jobs. Guess it was just your chip that didn't make it. First deadbeat we hired to do the job canceled. Hope a storm from the divide skins him alive. Well, that's where you came in. Getting skinned alive would hurt a lot, but he canceled. Yeah, I got this look when he saw you next down on the courier list. His expression turned right around. Asked me if your name was for real. Huh. I said, sure as lack of rain, you were still kicking. Then he turned down the job, just like that. I asked if he was sure it was good money. No, let Courier 6 carry the package. That's what he said. Like the Mojave'd sort you out or something. Then he just up and walked out. That is strange. Do you know who he was? Or where he went? Super good voice acting activated. No idea. Sounds like you two had a history for him to act like that. And turn down the money, too. Hope he didn't see any trouble in that package of yours. Maybe he thought your name was bad luck. Not for me to say. <laughs> Alright, let me see. I'll ask about the cowboy robot. You mean the one over there that I didn't see because you dragged me into this conversation immediately? Uh, but I'm just gonna assume there's one over there. Nope. Different fella. Bigger. Had himself a face on a screen. And he talked more like you or me. Alrighty, I'd like to ask you about something else. I guess I don't have anywhere better to be. Yes. No, you, you do not. Because talking to me is just the best place you can be on the planet. So, you should feel honored, sir. <laughs> I want to ask you some more about the delivery I was supposed to make. Didn't I already ask him everything about that? Sure, I'll tell you what I know. Yes, I did. I think. Goodbye. Don't go getting yourself shot. I already did. Twice. In the head. And plus, the times the powder ganger shot me. But that's okay. Let's talk to these people. I'd rather be left alone in my misery, if you don't mind. Your eyes are scary, sir. Okay, from there they aren't, but... From afar, they looked like evil. You! I want to talk to you. Hello there. What brings you to prison? I don't like the fact that you are pointing a gun to my genitalia, ma'am. Could you please lower the gun to the floor or, or holster it or something? I just, I don't, I, it makes me feel uncomfortable. So I'm actually, I'll see you later. Bye. That was a horrific bye. <laughs> she was like, bye. Ah. My bones are turning into dust as we speak. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, I cannot take that. 
I'm gonna exit. I don't want to steal anything. I don't want actually. Just in case I steal anything, I'm gonna quick save so that way nothing bad happens. Slag spike. Sunset to Hesperilla. Hey there. Before the powder gangers came to town, Johnson Nash ran the local store in the Mojave Express station. Okay. Right that a kick in the head. Okay, it's enough of that. Let us leave. These people are useless. Whoa! Oh, this is the robot that that oh is over there that I mentioned. Howdy, partner. Welcome to the Vicky and Vance Casino and Museum. Who are you? Who were Vicky and Vance? Tell me a bit, Prim. What is this place? Uh, what is this place? Why, this is the Vicky and Vance Casino and Museum. <laughs> I just told you that. Prim's premier tourist attraction and resort destination. Yeehaw! Premier? Oh my god. This game has some pretty horrible puns in it. <laughs> Who are you? Prim Slim at your service. Authentic cowpoke and official spoke spot of the Vicky and Vance Casino and Museum. Yeehaw! Sounded like you kind of strained your vocal cords there saying that yeehaw. Uh, goodbye. Happy trails, partner. I think Vicky and Vance were like, uh, they are like, uh, the something in Clyde of this world. Uh, what's it called? The something in Clyde? Uh, they're like, you know, robbers, partners in crime, whatnot. Let's talk to this person. You come to the wrong place, Traveler. Prim's dying. If you got any sense, you'll be moving on. Hey, if you got any sense, you'll be moving on into the afterlife! Ah! Oh, out of ammo. Okay, time to reload. <laughs> oh, that didn't happen. I should probably switch guns, actually. So that doesn't happen again. <laughs> okay, we'll go to our single shotgun, because we have a bit of ammo. Yeah, I actually have quite a bit of ammo for that. I was reading 112, but apparently I have dyslexia. So <laughs> that happens a lot to me. All right, I like the sights on this. Just a little dot. Boop, you're dead. What happens if I aim at him? What does he say? He just nods a bit. Jittery. You okay there? Kind of remind me of the irresponsible dad from Happy Wheels. Oh, you! I didn't see- Oh, no, 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 you're the evil dude. Alright, time to leave. Bye! <laughs> the king is dedicated to the cause of independence and personal liberty. It's a bit free side. His gang, the king, <laughs> attempt to keep some semblance of order in the streets. Okay. Alright, saving. Good, good. Let's see, should I explore the other places? Usually whenever there's a building and I explore it that isn't part of quest, it's really horribly scary and full of baddies. So, uh, I don't like going in buildings or vaults or caves unless I really have to. There's sometimes good loot in there, but you'll be wasting all your ammo and med kits and pooping yourself. Oh god! What? What? Ouch! No pain! Hold on! Time out! That isn't okay! I should probably use vats because my aim is really bad right now. Okay. You, sir. You, sir. You are going to not get shot because I don't have a good chance of hitting you. You, on the other hand... Ah! Low AP. Okay, never mind. Boom! Ouch! This is bad. I think... Oh! <laughs> His knee. Oh my goodness gracious, this gun is awful. I can't hit anything with it because it takes too long to reload. Alright. Ah! Okay, we'll just shoot him. Ugh. Look at that damage. Okay, I need to heal up. Hold on. Time out. Uh, uh, T-O while I actually heal myself a bit. Let's take some stim packs. Let's do that. Okay. Good. Only three stim packs to heal up fully. And, uh, let's see, we need a different gun, because this gun is just completely disgustingly awful. So we're gonna be using this. <laughs> I knew this would come in handy. We're gonna drop that, because that's just garbage, that gun. Okay, sorry, peeps. Oh. <laughs> well, that was easy. Oh, you just need the proper gun. Wowee. <laughs> sorry about your limbs, just kidding. No, I'm not. Okay, take this, this, that, that this and these and then we'll go over here and we'll take this this that this and this that and that and then we're gonna actually we're gonna switch to a logical gun even though this gun actually does a lot of damage and is pretty good 
we're going to, oops, we're going to switch to our 9mm that we are going to repair with this 9mm. And, uh, yeah, we have quite a bit of ammo for this, so that's good. We, he probably has some more. Yep, he does, and more to repair it with. Bobby pin is useful. Bottle caps, always good. And I'll take the dynamite, even though I don't really use them. Actually, so let's repair some more. I can't really repair it much more, but it is in pretty pristine condition now. It's past that little line that says, you're good, buddy. So, let's see what's in here. I can open the cash register, pre-war money. I'll take it. Uh, oops, escape, exit, immediate, paperweight. Why would I want the paperweight? Ooh, there's caps. Look at that. Look at these caps. Why do I keep taking a sip from my trusty campaign canteen? And I, why can't I never pronounce that correctly? Ooh, what's that? Ooh, it's locked hard. Can I even, like, lockpick it? Actually, I'm gonna save, and then I'm gonna try lockpicking it. Uh, I can't? Aw, oh, lame. Okay. Empty new cola bottle, pack of cigarettes. No thanks. Um, let's see what else is there in here. There's a toy car, and there's really horrifying ambient music playing, so I'm just gonna, I'm gonna take this teddy bear and save him from the scariness. Keep him with me in my bag. I'll name him, I'll name him Roosevelt. Does he get it? Teddy Roosevelt. <laughs> and then, uh, he'll be my friend. Alright, let's see. Oh, there's enemies. Oh, they saw me. Okay. Yeah. Oh, your your gun seems to be sticking through. What is that? Incinerator. <gasps> he has an incinerator. Oh, that isn't good for me. That is not 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 good for me at all. No way possible is that good for me. <laughs> incinerator is pretty much a fire machine gun. It fires Hadokens. It's the Hadoken gun. And why is his like freaking? Okay, we're actually we're gonna take away our things. Take that. And then uh okay, this does more damage, so we're just gonna we're gonna shoot him a bunch in the head. Hopefully hitting all of them. Yeah, oh boom, bam, this is looking bad for me. Ouch, pain, pain. Oh no, he's gonna he's gonna use this on me. The incinerator, it's gonna hurt so bad. Oh god, he fired a Hadoken. You can see it. I wanna cripple his head. I only have a slight chance of hitting him, but it's okay, because I'm gonna shoot him. Boom! Oh yeah, I got him! Head crippled, and I'm on fire. This isn't looking good for me. I wanna shoot him dead, though, so he doesn't Hadoken me anymore. What? Where'd his gun go? <laughs> oh, there it is! Why do you put his gun away? Ow! Oh, nice hitting your friend, loser. I need to heal. <laughs> oh, look at that. I'm on fire. You can see it in my bit boy. That looks really neat. Okay. <laughs> We need to eat some stem packs. Just eat them. Don't inject them. Don't like eat it. That's how you. That's how you get your health. Okay, that should be good. I kind of want to reserve my health. Just kidding. <laughs> okay, sir, please stop firing your hadokens at me. I really don't appreciate it, and I'm running out of ammo. That's just wonderful. It's splendid. Okay, we're gonna have to. We are. We are gonna have to use the. This. Sorry, fellas. You're in for a heap of trouble. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> Alright, fellas. Boys, I've come to play. Are you really gonna try and hit me with- Okay, this'll hurt me more than it hurts you. Just kidding, it'll hurt you more than it hurts me. Yeah, boom! Ah, oh, my arm is crippled. It's lame. <laughs> okay, in order to heal a crippled thing, I don't care. Let's go to our thingy-majig. Bobber stats. Okay, we need to heal the back. So we'll heal that. Heal our torso, because we really need this. And then, there, now we're all good. Items, aid, we'll use our last stim pack. Oh, and then we will use super stim pack. Mm. No, that's only in times of need. We'll eat some things. Have this rat meat, purified water. Um, healing powder. And then we'll eat, like, I think we should use a doctor's bag because, like, we're in, we're in kind of bad shape, body part wise. So we'll use that, whoops. Use that, and then we'll, we'll drink some dirty water. There, we should be good now. All right, is there anyone else who wants to mess with me? No. Rat meat has worn off. Okay. Sun sunset sarsaparillas. Good, good. All right, now let's search these fools for their ammo. I don't like the nine millimeter pistol. It kind of sucks. Ooh, look at that. Both their legs are gone. Look, frenzies. Except this one has a missing arm, and this one has both of his arms. Okay. Uh. 
Uh, do I want the flamer uh, and flamer fuel? I don't. I don't know. But all I know is that I don't know. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I want the leather armor though, because my metal armor, eh. Mm, actually, no. It's it's use it's useful, very useful actually. I'll take this. This guy has a lot more. Look at him. He knows what he's doing. Bottle cap. Take it. Mentats. Merc. No. This looks cool, but that's all it is. Stim pack. Whiskey varmint rifle. Why do they all use the varmint rifle? It's such a bad gun. I guess it's good for me. It's like I don't even. I don't have to. I don't have to take as much damage because they're all using bad guns. So I'm not complaining. Yeah, wow, value forty for 100 NCR dollars. Lame. Nine millimeter pistol. Nine millimeter round. Rat meat. I am using a bad gun myself though, except for this explosive one. That one isn't a bad gun, but we're gonna repair these nine millimeters. We don't have a lot of ammo for that, so I guess we're just gonna have to use our explosive. <laughs> I was kind of reserving this for a time where we really needed to use it, but like I guess now is that time because we don't really have any ammo. Can I sleep here? Ah, yeah, I can. It is 7 p.m., so we're gonna sleep for 12 hours. 13 hours. Okay. 7 p.m. What? What? Oh, okay. Lame. <laughs> All right. Now let us play the waiting game. Shall we? Mm-hmm. I like the waiting game. It's very up close and personal. Okay. Waiting game is done. I'm, I apologize. <laughs> All right. I think we saved someone's life. Let us see here. Oh, I thought that was just a head on the table. Okay. Hello, sir. I don't suppose you came here to rescue me. I'd cross my fingers, but my hands are numb. You must be Deputy Beagle. I've got to get going. <laughs> That'd be so must, messed up. You must be Deputy Beagle. Why, yes, I am. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm in a bit of a predicament here. I'd be most appreciative if you'd set me free. How do I know you're not going to slit my throat when your hands are free? Mm hmm. <laughs> I hear you may have information on some of the cons that came through here with a guy in a checkered suit. How'd you end up being a hostage? I'll set you free now. I'll ask him the questions first. Indeed I do, good sir. And I would be thrilled to share that information with you as soon as I am released from captivity. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'll set you free now. Oh, that's just marvelous. I think I'll be making my way outside now. The air is a little close. No, 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 no. You tell me first. If you try to run away instead of fighting at my side, I'll kill you myself. <laughs> That's pretty insane. I didn't cut you loose so you could run away. Stick with me. Sure, run away. You don't look like you'd be much help. I'll do this. Oh, why, uh, of course. I'd never let you fight my kidnappers with my help. But without it. You lead the way. <laughs> Wait, you didn't tell me. You didn't tell me about... I do hope this ordeal will be over the soon. cons. Beagle, take a weapon. Can I take your weapon? I just hope I won't have to use it. I'll take your ammo. <laughs> I took... He just got a little gun. I'll, <laughs> I'll give him a melee weapon. Let's see, not actually. But I only have this cleaver, you see. And I kind of want the cleaver for maybe cutting up meat. I don't know. I might need the cleaver. So, like... Ah, whatever. Take it. Alright, let's get going. And depart, we will. You never told me anything about the freaking uh, dude in the checkered suit. Let's see what's up in this. A sensor module? Could be useful for building something, but I don't really like building weapons in this game. It's just strange, because I really like building things in real life and in games. What does that do? Nothing. Okay. Let it continue this way. Good sir! Are you holding your cleaver? Aha! Indeed, it is holstered in your cleaver holster that you have. Let's open this. I need a lock pick skill. I thought I already included in 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 um increased my lock pick skill to that level. Lame. Apparently not. You know what? Lock pick skills are for noobs anyways. So, uh, lame. <laughs> Let's see, is there any, I'm trying to look for salvageable items in here, like maybe weapons or something, but it doesn't really seem like there's anything, so let us continue on our way outwards, Sir Beagle. Let's go. Alright, I really want to find out, oh cool, I missed this. These usually have stim packs, oh look at all this, rebound, 
Eh, bad. Radex, that's good. T syringe and stim pack. I'll take the stim pack. I don't know if you can actually make stim packs, but that'd be cool. I probably should. If you can, I, I'm assuming they'd use empty syringes, so I should probably look for them. Uh, do I really want the incinerator? I used it a lot. Actually, yes, I think I do. Okay. <laughs> This'll be fun. I'm out of ammo for everything else, so why not? We'll take his incinerator things. Flamer fuel, 63. Thank you very much. Okay. <laughs> Wait, I can't use it? Oh, it's broken. <laughs> Lame. Lame. That's why he put it away and ran, because he freaking broke it. Okay. Well, that just seems like it's kind of useless weight, and I don't really want to get it fixed. So... Meh. Should I keep it? It's pretty much the Hadoken machine, so I'll, I'll keep it for that. <laughs> I don't have much skill in... Uh, what? Why is that there? I do hope this ordeal will be over soon. It's blinking on him. Dude... Thank you so much. Why is it blinking on him? What, what am I supposed to be doing? Where's my quest things? Where's my motivation? Okay, let's see. Quests. They went that way. Find Prim's lawn man and get information. Find the men who tried to kill you. Yeah, I need to get the information, dude. If we were to miss a convict or two in here, who'd know the difference? Oh, I know what I need to do. I need to... I need to bring Thank him outside. Thank you so much because he's a little girl and he, he's claustrophobic. So we'll go outside, get you your fresh air. I do need or want to look in here. Oh, look at that, three Nuka-Colas, beautiful. Uh, and my carrying capacity is 86 out of 210, very good. I'm just looking up what's here. There, there, there might be something useful. Uh, I don't think I wanna go in there actually. Okay, let's go. I'll let you get your fresh air and I, I'm sure it smells really bad in here. I just, I can't smell it because I'm not actually in here. Whoa, the Matrix! <laughs> okay, let us see. Let us see how will we be free. I'm trying to follow the marker, but the marker is on him. So I just need to remember the way out. And that way out is definitely this way. It's this way, right? I think. Is it here? That's the maintenance door. Can I? I don't know. <laughs> I can't lockpick that. Can I take this? What is that? Empty sarsaparilla. Lame. But I can take the cap. So that's cool. Is this the exit? Doesn't look like it. Uh, elevator button? The elevator is broken, but it looks as though it could be repaired. Okay. Well, I don't really see the need to repair the elevator right now. There's nothing in here that I want. Maybe there's something. I don't know. This game doesn't... It rewards you for looking around, but not too much. Not as much as a game like Bioshock Infinite or something like that. Uh, but but sometimes you can find like some super cool secret weapons. Ah, there. That's where we need to go. Okay, now that you have your fresh air, you weenie, tell me where the people went. Dude, are you seriously like stuck? What? Okay, then you're not gonna come out with me? Are you just... What? Did he go out now, or what's what's happening? Where did he teleport? I just, I'm so confused. Didn't I need to talk to him? Isn't that what the whole blinking thing was about? Very nice decoration. I really like the the the, the blood splatter. Very nice vibe. Gives it a very uh, old, you know, cucumber feel. I, What is that sound? It sounds like something glitching, like in Gmod. <laughs> okay, well, probably isn't that. Let's see, is this... Howdy. You. Deputy B. How did you get all the way over here? There you go. Well, that was quite an adventure. We taught those convicts a thing or two, didn't no, we? No, I did. Breaking myself out of a hostage situation. Not to diminish your role in it, of course. But it was quite thrilling. The only thing you did was walk. <laughs> Problem is, there's still no law in Prim. What are we to do the next time ruffians menace us and hold us hostage? You, sir, do not deserve any credit because I killed all of your captors. And the only thing you did was run over here or apparently teleport over there. I don't know. <laughs> all right, now I need to know about the man in the jacket suit who came through here. 
because you told me you'd tell me and you didn't tell me until we got out here, so now we're in here and now you need to tell me what you need to tell me. Ah, yes. My memory is much clearer now that I'm free from my I'm bondage. Cut your face off. I was uh, performing recon, gathering information on some of the powder gangers, when some great cons arrived with your friend in the suit. They were we talking about friend. some delivery they took from a courier. I assume that was you? Yes. They said they'd be heading through Nipton to Novak to meet a contact there. Oh, that's all I need to know. Okay. Uh, complete find Primus Lawman. Head to Novak through Nipton. Ask around Novak about your know, attackers. Howdy. Neat! Coolio! Swagalicious! <laughs> uh, looks like we're heading to Novak now. And once we get there, once we get to Novak, then our life will be complete. Let's see, is there any fast travel location? that we can go to to make this a bit easier of a trek uh nipton it's not too far of a, of a trek and there's no fast track travel location i can go to so we might as well just walk there it'll be interesting trying to come up with conversation <laughs> let's see what is this caravan out mojave delivery order four of six okay let's see caravan outfit uh Note added. Let's look at that note to see what it is. Quest misks. That one. Oh, there's a six out of six, too. Deliver the package at the north entrance of the Vegas Strip. By the way, a free side, an agent with a recipient will meet you at the checkout. Take position in the. Goody, goody, goody. Two oversized dice composed of fuzzy material. Uh, you now authorize agent. Goody, 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 package contains one oversized poker chip. Composed of platinum. Ah, this is the one for me. I was carrying the platinum chip, and that's why I got shot, because the platinum chip is really, really important. I forget why, which is probably good, because, like, I don't spoil things for anyone, but it might have slipped out. I don't know. It hasn't happened before, but could be. Can I pick anything off of these for survival? No. Is there anything in this destroyed little house that I can scavenge? Scavenge. 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 Oh, someone's living there. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna break in. That'd just be rude. <laughs> Alright, let us continue. To Novak. What's that? Is that a fire? Is there a hobo burning something in the trash can? I do believe so. I see fire. And I see a trash can. But where's the hobo? I do not know. The hobo's gone. But there's definitely a trash can that is on fire. And is near a children's play place. And someone was apparently way too fat. Uh, so, also, if I, if I, if my assumptions are correct, watch me defy gravity. Gravity will be defied here. Gravity! Defying! Moha! Look! Or someone glued this to the floor. Either one. Either one works. <laughs> Alright, let's go. See, the problem here is that there's grass growing through the solid metal. <laughs> Can I swing this? Oh man, I wanted to swing that. Lame. Okay. <laughs> no more distractions. To Novak. Ba ba da ba. To Novak. Ba ba da ba. Da ba da ba bum. What's that? Is that just another plant of some sort? It does look like it. Ugh. Yeah, it's just a cactus. I'm glad I saw it so I didn't prick my knee on that, because that would be horrible. <laughs> I saw you shouldn't have crossed the power. Oh gates. my god. Going to pay. That scared me a lot. And that dude isn't even looking at me. That was really unexpected. Hey people. Bye people. Powder gangers infamy guy. I don't care, you people are noobs. And scrubs. All at the same time. Don't run away. Don't don't you run away. I crippled like everything from you. You know what? I should have gotten my cleaver back from that dude, but just to humiliate him. I'm going to punch him to death, and, <laughs> you know, dude, I'm just going to deck you in so hard. Durr, er, boom, boom, bam, decked. Just for humiliation purposes. <laughs> Alright, let's take this. That's what you get for trying to fight me. Ha. You're not the bra- Oh, look, a cleaver. Dynamite. And I might as well take this because golly gee willikers, I have a lot of ammo for it. So, yeah, I've got a lot. 
so like this will be my backup weapon whenever I run out of ammo, but uh um I really don't like it. <laughs> Let's see, where are, where are the other people that I killed? Ah, here you are. I'm surprised they're not scattered more. But this dude definitely had losses his like Let's see. 20 gauge round. <gasps> Does he have the, uh, oh, he has a single shotgun. Lame. I hate the single shotgun. Straight razor? I'll take it. Stim pack. Um, let's see. 5 millimeter round. Bottle caps. Dynamite cleaver. Dynamite. Goggles. Helmet. Power gang. Varmint rifle. Take this to repair. The one I have. And then, and then, and then we can repair. Because this is in horrible condition. And then maybe... Let's see, do I have anything else to repair anything? Ah, yeah, we can repair this with that. Alright. Let us continue. We're all set now. Look at my face. Oh, yeah. It's not pasty anymore. Ah, look like a boss. In my cowboy hat and my leather briefs, there's a lot of radiation here that's bad for me. So I'm gonna walk around it and not touch those bare rules, cause then I'd get radiation and I'm gonna go feral like a feral ghoul. Yeah, like a feral ghoul, like a feral ghoul. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Like a feral, there's an enemy there. And I'm not gonna be scared because it's just a scorpion. A huge, gigantic scorpion. No, I'm just kidding. That's an ant. That's a giant worker ant. Oh, sorry, ant, but uh, I'm gonna have to shoot you now. I won't do a lot of damage. Not surprising because I have the worst gun ever. Is this gonna be a critical? I can tell by the. What the heck? What was that? That just was a complete glitch. Okay. Sorry, bud. I'm gonna- I mean, you were a threat. I don't know if you were attacking me or not. Or if you were like- but the, the thing said it was bad, so like... If I killed you for no reason, I- I apologize. <laughs> Alright, let's take this ant meat. Yeah, I'm definitely would- would eat. 10 out of 10 would eat. That's- that's what I always say anyways. <laughs> 10 out of 10 would eat again. Let's see, these weird rocks. That seem like they'd be squishy for some reason. I don't know why they'd seem like it'd be squishy, maybe because of the green, but they'd seem like when I'd walking through it'd go squish squish squish. Squish says the man. Look at that. Look at that view. It's beautiful. What is that? I think I might want to explore. Although this crossing looks like it could have a bunch of death claws. I'm just saying. Oh, I don't know. Novak is right there, but there's this freaking two giants shaking hands, so like, where to go? I don't know. I'm probably gonna go this way first, discover Novak, and then go over there. Because that seems like just the better idea. But like, I really want to go over there, because that seems freaking awesome. And just in case something bad happens, we're gonna quick save. So that way, if we die, it'll be okay. Let's see, there's a thing here. Oh, there's a lot of things here. Are they gonna attack me? Because, like, if not, then I'll just- I'll leave them alone. But, like, if they're gonna attack me, I'm- I'll just- I'll deck him. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you will. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you will, mate. Alright, I'll, I'll- I'll know how it is. I'll see you. I'll see you, brother. <laughs> okay, so this turns out they're nice enemies. Who'd have thunk? <laughs> Alright, let's see. Novak is apparently up there. I really want to go over there to those statues, though. Blast. Oh, let's see. How far are we away from Novak so I can know? Data. Data. World map. Pearls. PLS. Okay. We're really close, actually. So we're going to go over there to our destination. Grow some hair on our feet so we can be awesome and have hair feet. And, and feet hair, I mean, and then we can like we can we can put in a ponytail and and make sandals out of our hair that's still attached to our feet. Oh my goodness, it'll be amazing. Up there, please. Thank you very much. I took the shortcut. I didn't want to go all the way around this rock, even though I probably would have been there by now. <laughs> okay, 
that shortcut was apparently a, a useless rock climb cut. Actually, it wasn't, because I wouldn't have been able to get on top of these cars or on top of this house. And look at this, I discovered Nipton, not Novak. I didn't want to discover Nipton. Hey, but there, there does appear to be burning things, and this town looks to be really destroyed and distraught. Not surprising, considering that, like, it's the Mojave Wasteland. But, uh, oh god, they seem friendly enough. Uh, what's happening? What, who are you? Should I approach you? Don't worry. I won't have you lashed to a cross like the rest of these degenerates. It's useful that you happen by. Whoa. I want you to witness the fate of the town of Nipton, to memorize every detail. And then, when you move on, I want you to teach everyone you meet the lesson that Kaisar's Legion taught here, especially any NCR troops you run across. Well, you see, the problem with that, what everything you just said, the problem with that, is that I'm not insane, first thing. And the second thing is you said detail, detail. So you already have a bad place in my mind. You know, we already have a grudge. So uh, your crime, he's like nailing people to crosses and stuff. So your, your crimes are unforgivable, my sir. As are all crimes, if you feel strongly about it, attack us. And soon you won't feel a thing. Is that a threat? No, the only reason I won't feel a thing is because you won't even be able to hit me. Oh, I thought I had my grenade launcher. Well, boom! What? Is he invincible? Like, the fool? <laughs> okay, let me restate my awesome one-liner. The only reason I won't be able to feel a thing is because you won't be able to touch me. Golly, he has a lot of health. This is probably a really bad idea. Oh! Boom! Bam! This, yeah, this is a really, really bad idea. Okay. Okay. Maybe he was right in the fact that I won't feel a thing because I'll be dead instead of them not being able to touch me. Because I'm using this really, really bad gun. And I've got cornered. That's just, just great. I really, I really appreciate that house being there and the location it was. Because, like, oh man, I hope not everyone is this hard to kill. It's like, if they are... I mean, this game, this, I mean, this game, this guy has a name, so, like, I mean, I would predict that he's harder to kill than everyone else, but, uh, if everyone is as hard to kill as he is, then, uh, that's gonna suck, but I think I can do it. If I have enough ammo, I'm running out. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. We need to go this way and possibly reload. <laughs> do I even have any more weapons? I probably really shouldn't have done this. This whole attacking thing. I'll equip the pistol. Hey, you. Hey. Oh, got any grapes? No, 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 no. I don't have any grapes. I just... <laughs> oh, this is a really bad idea. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna stick to it. Because, like... Freaking... These people suck. And this... That dude was a... Was a D-bag. And I'm gonna do that. And... This. And I should be good now. Okay. Dogs. Die. Sorry. And then... Dogs die, 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 you. Ah ha! Retribution. Retribution. I just killed your leader. Are you all mad or what? Ah, die. I don't like the Caesars. Caesar. What? Quest. What is that wacky thing? That whoa, whoa. Is it this? Is that it? Is that it? Oh, I'm out of ammo. Look at that. See, they can't even touch me. These guys' aims suck. So my my whole one-liner wasn't too off. Oh man, I really should have bought, uh, freaking energy cells. Oh, whatever. I'm just gonna go in straight for it with, uh, yeah, because I'm just gonna go for it. It's my damage per second, nine. My damage is five for that straight razor. Damage per second is 14, and the damage is four. Okay, we'll do that. Yeah! Prepare yourself, good sir, for I will destroy your face. And you're trying to shoot my feet, and that's not really gonna work. Yeah, yeah. I haven't had enough. You haven't even hit me. You hit me like once. This dog is doing a better job than you are, and I killed it. So you pay for that. I will not pay for that, because you'll be dead, and I do not owe you any money. I do not owe any dead man a debt. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just carving his face up a little off the top, then. 
do you, do you wanna- Oh, I think I took a little bit too much off the top. You like are. You will all die for your heinous crimes. As heinous human beings. Yeah. 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 Yeah, this is taking a long time to kill. But it's really fun just slashing at them and not doing any damage Come to me on. whatsoever. Because their aim sucks. Good sir. I'd like to just to give you a little bit of a shave. Just, you know, I'm 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 try I'm practicing to be a professional hairstylist and facial hairstylist as well. So I just wanna you know, give you a little styling, clean up your beard a bit. I mean I know you you don't have any because I shaved it all off along with a couple layers of your skin, but uh that's just me. That's just my style. Item condition. Your weapon is in poor condition and can do more damage if repaired. Okay. You know, I'm going to equip my cleaver then. Because, obviously, that doesn't work. Yeah! Okay. This seems to be a bit more effective. I like how they're just not doing any damage to me because they suck. Yeah. Oh, the armor is really good, Come though. On. I think I might want it. You, sir, die. Please. Just quickly die. Just a jiffy. I honestly will not bother you anymore once you're dead. I I swear. Just like you're taking so much time to die, and you're not doing any damage to me. So this is just all useless and, and a worthless attempt on your part. I mean, I'm doing like I'm I'm destroying you people, but you you're not doing anything to me. Please get in the corner. Darn it! I was just gonna hack and slash at him. There. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. This is what you get for attacking an innocent town and saying detail instead of detail. If, if you say detail, this will happen to you. Oh, crippled your arm, and now you have no weapons. So, yeah, fight me IRL, dude. Oh, he picked up his weapon. <laughs> Too bad, because I'm just going to cripple your arm again. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whoa. Boom. There you go. Hated. Now that folks know you're bad, most people are right. Hey, I'm not bad. They're bad. I'm a good guy. Freaking scrub noob. Deep bag. Oh, cool. I leveled up. <laughs> Worth it. Even though I lost all my ammo. It's okay. Bad guns anyways. I need to buy guns. For sure. Barter. Uh, sometimes I want to buy guns. I might as well increase that to like 25. And then we'll put the guns to five and then we'll do these good 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 okay good and done a where's the that's the a button okay done awesome wow that was a slaughter it was to make up for the slaughter that they brought on these people owen and baru I think this might be a reference to something though because the wacky wasteland thing came up when I went near these guys. So like if you know the reference please tell me cuz I I don't understand. I don't that was my stomach if you heard. Uh, <laughs> all right. You people suck. They're hanging people to crosses and they've got people's heads on pikes and that's just messed up. So I did them I did them a deed. Oh man, look at that. Oh, that's just brutal. Let's see, where are the people here? Was there a dude over there? Where? Was that a bird or something? Can I untie these people? I think I might be able to. They're still alive. But they look really horribly tortured. Yeah. This person appears to be near death to remove them from the cross would kill them. And he's a powder ganger, so. Damn! <laughs> <laughs> I just chopped him in the, 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 the jewels with a machete. And all he says is, damn! Hmm. Seems legit. Ooh, That is morbid. AF. Oh, man. What are these people doing? It's just, ugh. Look at all these heads. I regret coming here, except I kind of don't, because I got to kill that dude who pronounced it tail. This person pews. Okay. <laughs> what about you? No, he's not any better. I'm so evil. Oh, there's an angry person. Or thing. Over there. I'm going to fight it with my machete. Because, like, I'm obviously good with it. Because I <laughs> killed, like, a whole team of jerks with it. Oh, there's scorpions. Hey, hey, don't attack me. 
I was being friendly. I was gonna... Hey, you don't really... You honestly... You don't need... I wasn't intruding on your property or anything, and you obviously, like, live here. But... Ugh. Sorry, sir. I just... I... I, I I'm sorry. You are not a little woozy. God dang it. He poisoned me. What the heck? Ash pile. Legion recruit armor? Whoa. What the heck, mouse? Okay. Legion recruit armor damage. Oh, they're just really high level, apparently, because they were taking no damage. They weren't having any of it. Ooh, a machete. Cool. I can repair, even though that one is in horrible condition. It's okay. Oh, no. I'm using a cleaver, not a machete. Blast. Bashed. Whatever. Ah! Ow, my eyes. Ooh, golly. Do I have a migraine or something? What the? Ah! Ah! Golly. Good gravy. That was horrible. Okay, I need something to cure this poison, though. Let's let's use this, that, this, use that, uh, this. I have a stim pack as well. Those are pretty low on health. Uh, drink that. Okay, there. We're we're good now. But uh, I want to search in here because they might have been. Oh yeah, sleeping in beds cures everything. Can I not sleep in there? Cannot sleep in enemies are nearby. Ah, I will find you, and I will kill you. Where's that enemy? Who are you? Oh, you're another scorpion noob. No, 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 no! Please don't touch me. Please don't touch me with your with your stinger. Yeah, yeah. Oh, bam, boom. The scorpion's pretty tough. Ho, ho, ho! Show me your moose. Aha! <laughs> oh, look at that! I cut off all of his legs. Sorry, buddy. All right, now I could probably sleep because. I know, in Fallout games, sleeping cures literally everything. It's like the greatest thing ever. Oh look, it's a Wastelander. Oh, he just has an outfit. Lame. What's that? <gasps> Laser rifle! What's this? Lottery ticket? Cool. I'll take all of it. Uh, I can't believe I got a laser rifle. That's awesome. See, like, sometimes you'll get super lottery tickets. Sometimes you'll get, uh, cool things from searching. But other times you won't. Let's sleep for 13 hours again. And now... We play the waiting game yet again. So how are you doing there? Sitting, probably, watching... Okay, never mind. Waiting game is over. <laughs> Whoa! Hello there. It's good to see a friendly face. How do you know I'm friendly? I almost took you for a raider, I did. Name's Malcolm. Malcolm Holmes. Malcolm in the middle? Don't suppose you'd care to trade. I'm missing a few essentials and... Ah, oh, screw this. Lying just ain't in my nature. I'll tell it to you straight. I've been following you for a good bit now. What? Why are you following me? It started off innocently enough. I was traveling, as I often do, and happened to observe you picking up one of those blue star caps. You didn't show any reaction to it, so I figured you didn't know what you'd gotten your hands on. Uh, oops, sorry. I kind of zoned out a little bit there. And that's my knuckles. Nonetheless, what's so special about those caps? There's an old wasteland legend that says somewhere out there is a fabulous treasure from before the war. Those caps with the blue star on them, the tale goes, are the key to that treasure. They're called Sunset Sarsaparilla Stars. Hmm. Where can I find more of these caps? Do you collect these caps also? I have, I'm not collecting them. What kind of treasure are we talking about? No one knows. Money, weapons, water. It is, or maybe was, something of value. And that's enough to get people motivated. Where can I find more of these caps that you collect these two? Thanks, Rian. I'll do that. No problem. If you do end up trying to collect more stars, watch out for a man named Alan Marks. He's killed several people for their stars already. Oh, man. Wait, hold on. I want to give you mine for money. I don't need them. Huh? You want to talk some more? Uh, I'd like to trade. Oh, that's right. Here, let me show you what I've got on hand. Cool. I would like to take everything you want. Can I, like, give him my star or something? Is that on a misc? Aid? Misc. Star, star. Sunset. Sun something. Uh, Sunset Sarsaparilla? Star? Ah. I don't know. I, I, I don't have it. I'm sorry, sir. Value 30? He'll give me $6? You freaking suck, dude. He sucks a lot. <laughs> okay, let's see. Ball cap. With glasses, Brahmin skin outfit, frag grenade, rad X. I really just want like. Let's look at my weapons. Actually, I've got items, weapons. I've got that, the laser pistol, 
the laser rifle. I need, um, energy cells. MF cell for the laser rifle. Huh. Okay. Uh, machete, mercenaries, grenade, plasma pistol, straight razor. I'll give you this. I don't, I don't, well, mm, I should probably keep it. Varmint rifle. Lame, lame. Uh, weathered pistol. Hmm. He doesn't have anything that I need. You suck, sir. You you do suck, indeed. Hold on, I want to speak more. Maybe you have something I want. Huh? You want to talk some more? Not really, but, uh, no. I actually have if to If you say going. so, maybe we'll meet again. Yeah. Since you follow me, weirdo. But you seem friendly enough, so I'm not actually going to kill you. Lucky, lucky person. Anyways, back to, to sleeping. I wanted to sleep, didn't I? And now it's dark out. I don't even know why it's dark. Is it just dawn? Okay, I think it's dawn, so it's okay. Alright, let's continue on our way to, to, to Novak, because we entered wherever we are, and but it's not where we want to go. We just got distracted by these legionnaires, or whatever their names are. Okay, cleaver dynamite, 9mm pistol. I just want to use something that I have ammo for. I've got ammo for that. Uh, farmer rifle, I've got some ammo for that. 10mm pistol, ah, let's use that. Okay, welcome to Nevada, the Silver State. Oh, am I? Was I not in Nevada before? Okay, I guess I am in now. Cool. Nevada. Yes, I am now in Nevada. All right, gotta look both ways for the trains, you know, because they run. Ever they, you know, they run a lot after the war, the nuclear war. <laughs> yeah, trains are definitely working. <laughs> All right, we're almost there. I can tell. Um, I kind of remember this place. I think in there that bin, there's like a, a gauntlet or something like that, like a, a, a slashy gauntlet that you wear in your hands, that could be useful. So let's go in there and see if we can find anything. <laughs> Alright, let's see, there's some broken glass, or no, that's actually a broken branch, that looked like glass. Let's see, 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 do you see, do you see, whoa, calm down box, golly. What? How did that fall? <laughs> okay, whatever. Doesn't matter. I'm, I ain't scared of nothing. Okay, to exit. Exit. Wrong button. There we go. Okay. Toaster. What? Who? Where? Ah! Oh! Oh! Who's shooting me? And why? Who are you? Why do you suck? Ah, you suck because you can't hit me. That's why. Okay, let's see. I cannot hit, like, anything through this, so I'm just gonna have to shoot him like this. Oh, look! There's more people! Oh, wow! Okay, they're viper gunslingers. Why do they have a grudge against me? Do they want to take my stuff? You are not getting anything from me, sir. Yeah. Okay, Bats is just failing me completely in this game so far. So, like, I'm just gonna... Yep. Whoa. Okay, let's see. Can I hit him better now? <sighs> Good enough. 74% for what? 74... What is that? No, 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 no. I do not want that. I want the one where I get a 70... Ah, the right arm. Alright, sorry about this, except I'm not. I'm trying to get you to drop your weapon. Ooh. Okay, I hit, I hit her once. It's okay, it's okay. Hit her some more. Boom! Oh, right in the throat. Ooh, right in the eye. Sorry about your vision. I'm just, I'm just kidding. I, if, if I say I'm sorry about anything when I shoot you in the head, I actually am not. Then I made me new. Oh, look at that! Leap of justice and faith. Look at you, you trooper. You're a, you're a trooper, you are. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Bad idea, bad idea. Okay. <laughs> All right, well, we'll go. We'll go hand-to-hand -hand combat. Hand-to-hand. -hand. Hold on, let me let me give you a haircut. You need a haircut, sir. Your haircut is vile. It's a really cool-looking mohawk. Where are you going? Like that? <laughs> you like that? What? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Calm yourself there, Viper Mc McGee. I'm just gonna hit you a bunch, if, if that's fine with you. Yeah! Ooh! Ouch! Yeah! Ooh, just a little bit off the top. Oh, I hit him in the groin. <laughs> Why did you even need bats for, like... Oh, there's a mine! Oh, wow, cool! Glad I heard that. You didn't, though, obviously. Oh, he's got a machine gun, 9mm submachine gun? Yeah! I'll take it. Gladly. I'm glad I ran across these dudes. I get to 
I get to take their weapons. Where's that dude I killed? Oh, hey, look, it's another guy just running against this place. Why do they Why do they all insist on running against the wall like this? I don't know. But run against the wall no more because you're dead. Up close, kill enemies with melee weapons. But I don't, I'm not a melee person. I am a gun person. But, but guns are definitely... Definitely, yeah. Uh, they have ammo. <laughs> Bottle cap, duct tape, right away, right away. Ooh, awesome. Turpentine. Okay. Let's see. Is there anything in here that I really, really wanted? Where's that gauntlet thing that I was talking about? Open desk. Is there a desk under the ground? How did I even get into there? There is a desk under the ground. Wow. <laughs> okay. Gun cabinet. Ooh, awesome. Oh, cool. Wow, look at all that. There is actually stuff there. Uh, okay, apparently not a gauntlet thing. But uh, I do have weapons now, and that is very handy. I'm gonna go up here and try and find any drops from the people who are fighting me. Yeah, there you are. Let's see, 9 million submachine, anti-venom, awesome. That could have been useful earlier. Bottle caps, metal spoon, motorcycle helmet, no. Okay, that's all I need. Now, let us do things that involve other things, like repairing this with this, and then just repairing anything whether 10 millimeter. Okay, let's let's put up take the thing with the thing. Submachine gun pistol. Um do I want the submachine gun? Damn much damage. Okay, well this does more that does a lot more damage per second. I'll use that. But that also wastes a lot more ammo as well. Mm, nah. I'll just have to hit them more. Okay. Alright, I am good. Now I actually have a gun. Look at this. It's like the old school World War I guns. This is neat. Looks steampunky almost. Oh, oh, ow, 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 owie, ow. Why would you do that to me, Road? I thought we were friends. You suck. Well, at least I have a doctor's bag, but still, you, you suck. Where's my doctor's bag? Ah, there you are. Ah, oh, golly. Okay, let's take, uh... Stimpack, super stimpack. I'll just drink some of these. Okay, I like how you get the bottle caps after drinking it. Really neat, neat feature. Mm, yes, yeah, quite. <laughs> so if you pay a bottle cap for one of those, it's pretty much just a free drink. But you never pay one bottle cap for anything. The merchants are always. Oh, was that a mine? That looks like a mine. But that wasn't a mine. Okay, so I'm thankful. I'm gonna stay off the road. But the merchants are always trying to squeeze every dime, or bottle cap in this case, out of you they can get. <laughs> Alright, it seems like the path to Novak is really dangerous, and is taking a lot longer than I had anticipated, which is why this episode is pretty long. <laughs> but it's okay, long episodes are good. I like long episodes, yes I do. And, uh, Gouda Gouda, how about you? <laughs> okay, let's see up here. Maybe I can take a shortcut. Mm, yes, quite. <laughs> up, up, thank you. Up and down and left and right. Hey, it's a bridge. How convenient. I think I see it. Music. Ah, it's the radio. Let's see, campfire? Can I, can I cook anything? Do, 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 no, I cannot cook anything. Okay. It's okay. I don't need to cook anything anyways. Uh, goodbye, radio music. I will miss you. Just kidding. No, I won't. <laughs> Let's jump and jump. I'm getting a lot more doctor bags than I remembered getting last time, which is really useful, though, because that way I don't have to waste a stim pack on a limb. I can just take a doctor bag and be good. Use my medical things for healing, like how they're supposed to be used. Let's see, how far away is this freaking thing? It feels like it just keeps getting farther and farther and farther. Oh my god! Novak is all the way... Did I just take a super detour or something? Or like... Well, ah, whatever. We're close enough. I'll make it this episode, I promise. <laughs> I'll make it this episode if it kills me, if it does. Okay. Oh, we've actually accomplished quite a bit. I see an enemy, though. What is this? Freaking mole rat? Really? <laughs> that was fast. Okay, sorry, mole rat. 
but uh, kind of suck. And you don't even have mole rat meat on you. You must just be a skinny, skinny dude, or something like that. Did I see anything over there? Nah, I don't think I did. Okay. Oh, there's a red thing right here. I don't know what this is, but I sure hope it's not killer. Let's see. Ah, it's a mole rat. Boom! Bam! Thank you, ma'am. Bam! Jam. <laughs> There you go. Alright, let's see. Do you have any more rat meat on you? Aha! Uh -huh. I think you do. Yes, you do. Exactly. Yeah, yeah it's quite. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Is there... I thought I was gonna do... So oh yeah, wait. I was going to wait. Because it's 5 a.m. 5, 6, 7, 8. I'll wait to 8. Seems good. Alright. Now it is nice and daytime and bright and delicious. So now we can travel without monsters being on our booty. Oh, but the lag spike of doom will definitely be on our booty. That's for sure. <laughs> All right, let's see. What is that? Is that a... It's, a... it's Rita's Cafe. Ooh, that sounds good. I'm actually hungry right now. What? Who's shooting at me? Why are people so mean? I don't think he was shooting at me. I think he was shooting at something else. But now he's shooting at me. What? I... Oh, God! Oh, you jumped out of the bushes and I didn't even see you. Yeah! Oh, God, your head just completely went away. Okay. Let's see, where else? Where else? Small rat, die! <laughs> Delayed sound effects there for some reason. Okay, now you can lay with your friend. Ah, oh, how sad. Okay, I heard shooting, though. I heard guns. Oh, there they are. Is this... Are these Caesar's Legion scrubs? They are. I think I might want to kill them. Oh, that's neat. Viper Gunslinger. Oh, cool, and they didn't take anything, and I can use those for my, my, my grenade launcher. That's a grenade rifle. No, I have a better one. <laughs> What's that? Pinion nuts? I can just eat those. Stimpak. Sweet. Thanks for not looting these people. You guys just take everything. Fork, a knife, medex, scrap metal. Oh, I think I might want the knife. Take the knife. Okay, you. Recruit Dick Deconis, you thank you for all of the help. Fixer, it's another knife. I'll take it. Vodka. Uh, but 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 uh, you're part of Kaiser's or Caesar's Legion, are you not? I'm gonna talk to you. Give me cause, profligate. What? When the time comes, I'll be the one to kill you. Oh really? Well, I don't think the time is going to come for you at all, because. You see, I don't know if you know this or not, but you can't really kill people without a head, so... <laughs> oh man, that was a bad idea. That was a really bad idea. He's not taking any damage. Okay. Yeah! Yeah, okay, that was a horrible idea. I'll just let him keep his little girly threats. But, just because I really need this ammo. And they do not die easy. All right, head to Novak through Nibs and ask around Novak about your tap tap cackers. Find the men who tried to kill you. Oh, okay. The, I was supposed to go to Nipton. I thought Nipton was Novak, but it wasn't. Oh man, this fall damage is gonna suck a bit. Yeah. Ow. <laughs> it's okay. I quick saved recently. <laughs> okay. Let's go on the road actually instead of falling off of a cliff. I'm really glad I quick saved, or else that would have been horrible. Just in case, just, you know, you never know. <laughs> Alright, we're almost there, my friends. We are almost to the sacred land of Novak. And then I can get something to eat, because I'm actually really hungry and I'm quite tired, because it's 3.53 a.m. <laughs> oh, hey, a friendly. Where is this, where is this friendly, I see? Where are you? Friendly? Friendly man? What is this? Ranger station? Charlie? Nice. Okay, friendly man, I'd like to speak with you, friendly man. Please? Friendly man, PLS. Gooby, please. Huh. Is this friendly man Gooby? I want to talk to Gooby. Gooby, I'm your biggest fan. Gooby, please. Gooby! Oh, where'd he go? I thought he was here. Oh, I'm on top of him, apparently. Hello? Anyone home? Hello! Oh no, I think I'm stuck. Oh! Ah, snap-a-doo. Snap, crackle-pop. Ah, uh, how do I get out of here? 
Okay, this way. That's how I get out of here. There, that's better. Okay, I'm gonna talk to this friendly man if it kills me. Well, maybe not if it kills me, but I want to talk to him really badly. Friendly man. Friendly man. Can I take your things? I don't think you need any of this. No, I don't either. Listen to this heroic music. Where's the friendly man? Is he in here? Let me see. Friendly man. Oh, hi there. It's a friendly woman. I think. Yes. Hello there, friendly woman. When I got this assignment, I was hoping there'd be more gambling. Lame! You don't even actually speak. You suck, friendly woman. Okay, on our way to Novak. Well, we quick save, so we can we can be more comfortable and walk on the train tracks, because that's how it goes. There's less likely to be landmines here. I hope. <laughs> okay. Just slowly traveling. Look at these phone, phone things. They're so anti-phony because because they did cut that because they're they're not not real oh that's novak oh yes novak <gasps> this is where we can meet boone <gasps> boone yes quite black mountain radio station but th that's a giant dinosaur your eyes don't deceive you no 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 but it's not living so it's okay but but oh that's awesome i really want to befriend boone i really like boone boone is great and he has uh, the most story out of all the companions. Uh, and he, he's he's really cool. He's a really cool guy. Really cool dude. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. I took another sip from my canteen. I don't know what that does. But uh, apparently it makes my character feel better about himself. So, it's okay. And how much water is in there? Anyways, I have discovered Novak! Huzzah! Oh, I finally discovered Novak. And there's a cattle. There's, there's, there's a Brahmin, actually. It's the two-headed cattle of the world. Hello, Novak settler. If it weren't for the water caravans, Novak would have turned to dust a long time ago. Yes, quite. Alright. We're gonna get a good look of the dinosaur, and then we're gonna end it. Because this episode's been going on for quite a bit. And I'm hungry and tired all at the same time. So, <laughs> I need to eat and look at the dinosaur and sleep. And good recording is good. I hope nothing goes wrong with it, because that would just be awful. And if you're seeing this right now and hearing me say that, then nothing did and I'm happy. So, with this beautiful image of the dinosaur holding up the motel sign, uh, on behalf of me and the dinosaur, I will end it here. If you liked the episode, please leave a like down below. Better yet, leave a comment telling me any thoughts or whatnot you have on this. Uh, and I will see you all next time.